Hi there, I'm meteorologist Meg McNamara. We are live with the WJZ Mobile Weather Lab in Roland Park. And I have brought in some backup. So I have some weather assistance with me. This is Ramsey, Lath, and Jad. Gentlemen, how old are you guys? I'm seven, nine, ten. Ten years old. And of course, it's not just the warmth that we're talking about, but also the cicadas. So we've been studying up and we want to talk about how many cicadas can be per acre, Jad? There can be per acre about 750,000 to 1.5 million. Amazing. And how do you feel about the cicadas? I don't really like cicadas and I'm scared of cicadas. Okay, I can't really blame you for that. And Lace, what about you? Um, I'm just scared of touching them. Have you ever touched one? Uh, uh, I've been forced to pet one. Oh, I hope one of your brothers didn't do that to you. Uh, no, somebody at school did. Oh, how rude. Okay, well, we also, though, we are loving the sunshine. However, Ramsey, you're a little toasty, aren't you? Yep. You wish we had some shade? Uh-huh. Are you a little too hot? Yeah. Just a tad. Okay, but for all the details, of course, on the temperatures, we want to send it over to meteorologist Chelsea Ingram. Take it away, Chelsea. That's right. Oh. Thank you so much. That was so cute. You know what? The great thing is, though, cicadas do not sting or bite, so they will not hurt you. But yeah, they're kind of gross looking. I took this picture actually earlier this morning. They are interesting creatures, that's for sure. Let me show you a look at some temperatures across the region. We'll get you started with the weather forecast now. We are checking in with numbers that are in the 70s and 80s. Areas closer to the water are going to be a little bit cooler simply because of the water temperature this time of year. 86 degrees currently at BWI Thurgood Marshall Airport, but in the state's capital, we're more than 10 degrees cooler there. Quite impressive. And it's 79 degrees down the ocean. It's 86 in Westminster, 88 in Frederick, and it is 83 degrees currently in Hagerstown. Lots of heat across the United States. Take a look. It's 81 in Louisville, 77 in St. Louis, 73 in Chicago. We've got warm air across the region, and we're going to continue on with this summer preview. Heading into the weekend, we're forecasting 90s. That's right, 90s, as we head into part two of the weekend on Sunday. We do have a cool down heading our way, though, by Monday, and it will be accompanied with the risk for some showers and storms. The bigger picture on satellite and radar, there's not a whole lot going on synoptically, which means large scale wise. So this area of high pressure across the uh, southeast and mid-Atlantic, it just ain't going to be moving anywhere anytime soon. So we stay with this really nice weather. We'll tap into mostly clear and mild conditions overnight. We drop down to around 60 degrees. That is a couple degrees above average for this time of year. Tomorrow, another very warm day with unseasonably warm conditions. Looking at temperatures, making it to around 87 degrees. That is also well above the average by more than 10 degrees. The average high right around 76 on Thursday. Here's a look at the bigger picture on future cast now. Heading into the next several days, it remains quiet. There is the risk of a little disturbance that's going to be sinking down from the north that could bring us a stray shower, especially for areas north and east as we head toward uh, later on this week and this weekend. But otherwise, you can just look for very quiet weather, folks, as we head into the next couple of days, at least through the work week. We will have more in the way of cloud cover on Saturday, 92 out ahead of some shower and storm chances Sunday. And and then we cool down by Monday. It's a cold front that moves through. Cloudy and cooler, 77 degrees. But then you know what? It gets hot again as we head into the middle of next week as well with a high of 90 degrees. And by the way, we haven't seen 90 since September 2nd of last year. We'll have more coming up weather-wise in the next half hour. For now, I'll send things back to you on TV Hill.